What is up, guys? It's uh, Mind Potter here, and we're gonna be doing another update video for the Mind Potter series. Um, some stuff I worked on this weekend. Let's get started. Okay, so as you can see, we already showed you this, but I changed up a little bit. Just did this now, actually. The entrance made it a little bit grander, I guess you could say. Um, I think it looks kind of nice. Uh, we basically just use the uh, cylinder we use for all the other towers um, for this one and put in some glass windows and all that. We're going to light it up a little bit and it'll look pretty cool. So that's the entrance to the Great Hall and the courtyard. And now to the good stuff. So I showed you this building last time, the Grand Staircase building, and I haven't done a whole bunch with this. Um, I have done some stuff with Dumbledore's office though, um, which see in a previous video. Here we go. Go in. So right away you can see I changed this, like I said I was going to, to be kind of more wood. Um, I think it looks a little bit better that way. And over here, you can see I put in this triangular glass window thing that kind of makes it have a little more texture, I suppose. Alrighty, climb up the stairs and come out to this glass pagoda thing, which I guess star watching, I don't know. Well, let me s emphasize, uh, in the real world, uh, when we do this, we put it into a new, another world. Um, you won't ever see the outside of this building. <laughs> um, so, just, you know, let me say that just because people are nice to so. No, you'll never uh, see the outside of this building. Okay, so that was that. Another thing that um, I have, which, oops. so like I said, this is where the entrance to a lot of the cool stuff is, like Gryffindor Common, for instance, and that's what I was working on today. I think that'll be up here somewhere, maybe right here, or right here, I haven't decided yet. Anyway, Gryffindor Common will be up here. Now you're wondering how we do that if it's cylindrical, and can't we build off of here? Well, I'm going to do the same thing uh, when I get done with those office. Here's an example of what an entrance might look like. Of course, I'll use a bigger picture, and I'm going to retexture all the pictures so the Griffin or Comedy will be a fat lady and all that good stuff. So, here's what it looks like. You're going to walk in, and then there you go. Boom. Through the fireplace, just like that. Go through and the Gryffindor Common Room. So let me show you around here. This is a new place I built. Um, I think it turned out really well, actually. I was really surprised. I, it's hard to make it kind of feel this cozy. Uh, I wanted it to be kind of cozy and, uh, like that. And actually, this is really funny. This block that you see here on the rug, let me show you that. That's actually Netherrack. And it's surprising because Netherrack is usually really ugly. In the default texture pack, Awful. We have to see another rack. I think it makes a nice fuzzy rug feel. And I used it uh, to adorn the tapestry that goes around, as you can see here. And I haven't quite fixed this yet. I put it in a floor and I forgot about that when I made the seal, uh, the crest, I mean. So I have to fix that. It kind of got cut off here. Um, but I might put this in every common room. I haven't decided yet. Uh, one thing I might, I'm going to mention now, though, is every common room is not going to be the same. Um, this is just Gryffindor Common Room. Um, Slytherin, I know, is definitely going to be different. I have some good ideas for that, but I'll share that in a later video. So we got this nice bookcase here with some comfy armchairs. Um, a desk, maybe some chests. Some wizard chests might go on in there. You never know. And then the dormitories uh, actually themselves are upstairs, so let me show you. There's a uh, boys' girls. Um, boys, I guess, on the left. Um, so you go up here. And you can look out on this balcony area, like where Harry does in the first movie. Christmas comes down and looks through there. But if you keep going, you go up into the dormitories. And the beds, beds are ugly. I have to retexture those. But So you walk in. And these are the dormitories. Uh, they're pretty sl pretty plain. There's nothing really. There's just a little window here. But other than that, other than that, it's just pretty normal. Um, it doesn't look like quite like it does in the, mo in the movies. Um, but... That was because 
it was just hard to do with the shape um, that I that I that I have. So we did our best. I think it turned out really good, really good actually. Okay, so let's go on the girls. It's the same thing essentially. Um, well, exactly. Same balcony. And if we go up, this is probably making us really dizzy. Anyway, so then same window actually, and the same layout exactly. So the Gryffindor common room, unfortunately, there aren't that many people in Gryffindor, or at least none of them can sleep here then. But that's fine. I was thinking about making it just floors and floors and floors, but that's not really aesthetically pleasing, and that's just too much work. <laughs> so that's the Gryffindor common room. Um, this took a while. Let me show you the outside of this building. Like, because we teleport to it, so obviously you won't see the outside. Um, but basically just a cylinder. Um, as you can kind of see by the cobblestone, um, this is kind of where the top ends. You can see the cutoff crest. Uh, bookshelf. And then the windows. There. So... But, like, like I said, you won't ever see the outside of this, so we don't have to worry about making it look good. So, yeah, that's the Gryffindor Common Um So, I've been pretty busy working on this, actually. I haven't... I know it looks like it's not a lot, but there's a lot of planning and stuff that goes into building everything, so... Um, looking pretty good so far, I think. Um, got Dumbledore's office... And we got we got some stuff to do yet. <laughs> a lot of stuff to do. So, yeah, this has been update for Mind Potter. I should start keeping track, but update number whatever for Mind Potter. I hope you guys have fun uh, watching my videos. And if you do, please like and subscribe. Uh, that would be great. And uh, tell your friends. We can get some more some more Potter fanatics. Alright, say bye to Harry's feet. I'll see you guys in a later episode. Bye, ya. Uh.